previously on Dump Warfare. Hey everybody, and welcome back to the toenail vlog. So today's episode, we're going to talk about more interesting things we can do with toenails. So today, if you glue them all together, you can make that boy you really like his toenails. <laughs> Would anyone like to sleep with me? I am sleeping. <laughs> Would anyone? Well, if you ask that way, no, absolutely not. That just means more Scott time for me. Yeah. More cuddling. Uh, I'll make the guy love rule sign. Guy love between two guys. <laughs> when I say I love you, Turk. <laughs> what I loved about I love you, Scott. Uh, Scrubs is that you knew when it ended that you were never going to see any of those people again. <laughs> well, the, the actors from it. But, but no, then they tried to... Oh, I see what you're saying. I knew, that's, GP. But they well, all do stuff, though. Like, yeah, well, like uh, Zach, Zach Braff had like, a very critically acclaimed um, film. He was in a film. Yeah, I grant you that. But no, he made one. He he was in a few. Yeah, and he voices dog a dog in a like dog food commercial now. Well, in that wow. case, I take it all back. Yeah, he's yeah. only the top line. And Doctor Cox, he also does commercials now. And Turk was I mean, in Turk was in some to, disaster film. To be fair, Doctor Cox was in films before then. Yeah, and was JD was in Broadway. Wasn't he in Predator? Yeah, uh, yeah. yeah Wait, hitting uh, me. He also oh, that's was a robot. In... That's not Scott. That's not Scott. He's going to kill me. Do you need Do you need help? I can't shoot him. Fly back this way, you idiot! Behind you. Where is he? He's hiding in a tree, like all robots. <laughs> that's what they do. You were talking about Predator, and he I killed him out from behind. I'm going for my oh, rewards. Wow. What is it? No, Nothing. let me get my rewards. <laughs> Damn you! <laughs> Oh, um, he also was in um, uh, Dr. Kimball. Uh, what's, what's the movie called? Uh, is it called Dr. Kimball? It's, it's Dr. Kimball, okay. Because in, in Germany it has a different title. I have no idea what you're talking about. Dr. Cox. Uh, Dr. Cox. No, I, I got that. I don't know what Dr. Know Kimball what is. Mean. Me either, but I'm assuming that's what it's called. Well... If you don't know an iconic film... If you don't know, then you don't know. I generally don't, GP. I know, I know some films, but especially actors. When people say an actor's name, I can't tell you a large majority of them. We need more dirt. There's only one actor I need to know, and that's Adam Sandler. <laughs> Everyone's favorite actor. Hey, in Happy Gilmore, he was spectacular. Adam, the, he's got some good films. In The Water Boy. I like uh, Water Boy. He was spectacular. Billy Madison. Billy Madison and Little Nicky are probably my two favorite Adam Sandler films. No, it's just always hard for me to... I mean, obviously, he's always been an actor regardless in his other films, but to take him as a serious actor. Well, I think the thing about Adam Sandler is he came along at the perfect time to... Um to what was that sort of era of, of teeny type comedy. Yeah. Um, you know, and it was it was the perfect time to for him to be in those films. But you that's know, why they, I said like now seeing him in serious roles, I can't take Adam Sandler seriously. If they made those if they made those films now, no one would watch them. Um you know, no, they, I think people would still watch stuff like Billy Madison. Uh, what did you say? Uh, why you did you say that? You ran in front of my face. You scared him, Scott. When I'm behind you, you want to worry. You call it worry, I call it hope. <laughs> Both acceptable let's terms. It, let's call it hope. I just wanted to be able to go back to the uh, guy love rules thing. <laughs> you will. Yeah. At some point, you will. I can't though, GP. I'm straight, so I have to miss out on all the action. Nobody all of the action. You have to. <laughs> be, be gay envy. That's the only place the action happens. Woo. I 
Feels Filled looking in. pretty good, Scott. Filled in your hole. We need to replace that stone in the middle there. Where? Where you're standing. Certainly at the front. Because there's a lawn, from what I recall, with a fountain. Is that a thing? Or am I making that up? You're making that up. It's usually like a hill type thing that goes down, and then there's a, a, fence. a big a big open grass area, and then the fence. Has that not got a fountain in? I don't know why I thought that had I mean, a fountain. There, I'm sure there's fountains, but not like right there in the front. Maybe you're thinking of the Washington Memorial, or monument, not memorial. I, which is in front of it, isn't it? Is that a thing? No. No. Oh. Is, it, is it just... Oh, shit. Is it just... Oh, shit. I think very, very many Americans will be offended by that. It's a bit shit. It's a bit shit. It I is. mean, it is, kind, it is kind of phallic shaped. And, and I mean, a little you know, bit shit. you're talking about a, a, a country with the Globe Theatre and with like Buckingham Palace and Sorry. castles and stuff. Yeah, you guys have pretty crap stuff. You need to get with the times, make some new stuff. How dare you? We've got a gherkin, god damn you. Nobody even knows what that Buckingham Palace is. Did we put horses in there? Yeah, some. Well, there you go. Now I know. Like Princess Anne. <laughs> wow. What? Nothing. Have you seen a picture of Princess Anne? Who hasn't? I'm guessing that's a no. Of course we have. You googling a picture of Princess Anne? No. Jordan, can you get some more dirt, please? I need to get a shovel. I've got a shovel. I've got loads of shovels. Oh, perfect. What do you need a shovel for? So I can get dirt. There's dirt in the warehouse. In the... No, that's where I was going, but then it was like, oh, we're going to harvest some there. No. Yeah, I'm on my way over there. GP's just standing there. Oh, I'm configuring the... The system. Mm, got a system. Yeah. Not just a system, he's got the system. I hooked up, well, the first quarter of the warehouse. Um, the new. I think I think I may have made an error. Generally. I may have made an error. A banana. I didn't say that. Well, I don't know. I said I may have made an error. You said. <laughs> yeah. That's what I said. A banana. Banana? We might need to... You know how when you go stay in a hotel, occasionally, yeah. unluckily, you get a room which is either night, right next to the road, right next to some roadworks, right next to the, like, the boiler in the hotel and it makes like noises through the night, right next to a couple uh, shagging and you're like, Mum, Dad, will you keep it down? Um, you know when that happens? No, I can't, I can't relate to any of these issues because I plan out the vacations beforehand. <laughs> We find out where the rooms are and we pick those. Wow, I wish I was that clever. Um, mm. Well, you gotta anyway, be American for that. We um, we seem to have be planning our hotel on um, on what appears to sound like a, a zombie house. Yeah, hear those? I hear. Nice. Don't worry, Scott, I have a brilliant idea. That, those are the servants, man. Yeah, and say we'll just make it look like they're hired help. They're building the wall. Oh yeah, that's the wall builders. See, we just you know kind of lie about it. He won't know any better. He won't be none the wiser. It'd be fine. I mean, he's American, so he's, he's very smart. Yeah, best, it's the best <laughs> brains. I agree. I don't. We're the Fact. best brainers. We brain everything we see. I completely disagree with that statement, GP. <laughs> Wow. Well, I'm allowed to say that. No, you're not. You're not American. What? Is that a thing? <laughs> yeah, that's how that works. It's American a thing? Yeah. All right, here we go. Cobblestone, 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 cobblestone. Granite. I like that song. It's a good song, isn't it? Pretty good. Do you want to join in? Sure. Cobblestone. Oh. 
Cobblestone, cobblestone, cop, cop, ca cobblestone. Ba doom, boom, boom. Is that how the song went? If yeah, I had a cobblestone. It's not the same since the remake. I like the original better. You're right. You guys don't make music like you used to. The heart's not there. Your genre changed. Who? What? I only like the original songs, the first couple albums. The new stuff sucks. Yeah, that's true. Isn't it uh, weird how that happens? With er like every band? Yeah, it's weird. Yeah. It's weird you just when get I like, those I albums think... you like, and then if their genre or sound changes at all, it's not the same. Mumford and Sons. When they, when yeah. they go commercial. I revert back to Mumford and Sons in this scenario every time. But the thing is, GP, some bands become significantly better once they go commercial. Yeah, that's true. But like, we made these songs to be played on the radio. It's like, yeah, I can see why. It's kind of catchy. Oh, did you did you see that Ed Sheeran um, had the wrestler had top uh, the top nine songs? Oh, sorry, uh, the top ten songs in our chart. He had nine of them. Yeah, you told us that. Uh, he um, uh, he um, out of the top like twenty, I think it was sixteen of his songs were in it. Something stupid like that. Which is crazy because I don't even know who that is. Yeah, I'm not surprised. I mean, he's pretty good, um, and he comes from round here, actually. Um, but because now streaming is a thing, now every song on an album is released at the same time, essentially, because so many people are listening to it, they're just all of his songs got... Um, yeah. Interestingly, did you know that for um, to get your one of your songs counted as a, a single uh, physical sale in the charts, you have to have it streamed a hundred times? What? Yeah, it's weird how that stuff works. So, essentially, to have, you know, for, to count as one sale. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I you got it. Why All right, is there you sheep just... again? Where? In the warehouse. How did the sheep get into the warehouse? There you go, Scott. What do you think? I think okay. this is perfect. Now, what does the White House look like? Uh, you know what I'm going to say? I don't know. It's a White House. So we need plastic, we got magnets. So the front of the White House is kind of cylindrical. So we're going to need something that kind of arches out and around. Right, let's get, let's see how much wool we've got, because I think wool could work, because we can't afford marble. Okay. Then at the back of it, it kind of expands out into two walls that are in the two separate wings that make up the White House. And it goes all the way back to... There's a I guess it's just the back. I don't, I don't ever really looked at... Oh, wait, no, the backs were like the, the back white door and all that stuff are. There's a little glass area back there. And a, a back little white path door. That oh, the wow. president could take. There's a white door back there. It's a little like white and glass door. Bearing in mind we only need to we, I mean we could make a Can we just make Big Ben instead? It seems a lot easier. Oh, Big Ben. He's a lot easier, I think. That or sounded, that everyone's sounded... favorite monument, Eiffel sixty five, or whatever they're called. I'm blue. Yeah. <laughs> da ba dee da ba da. Oh, we've got um, 17 stacks of marble. Do we? Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> What'd you make that noise for? Because I've been it waiting is. to finish the freaking factory. Marble it is then. No, we can't make the house that. That's going to go for our factory. I've got the White House marble. Let's go. No. White house. Well, we've still got 10 stacks. We should be fine. Come on. Let me finish the factory then real quick. No, yeah, we haven't got time to finish that. It's in desperate need of being finished. Is it? Yes. Oh. You know, what I just grabbed is not near enough to finish this. What are you planning on finishing? The ceiling. It's different. Crap, it is. Uh, it's gonna break the stuff around it, unfortunately. Do you have a normal pickaxe? Nope. I'm gonna do this. <sighs> right, I'm gonna make the White House. I don't remember what the White House looks like, and I'm not gonna Google it. That's Good okay. Luck. I'm not too bothered. Good luck, everybody. He'll do fine. Or, you know, I'll just end up tearing it down either way. Break the walls down. Put the cookie down.
Okay, um, right beneath it. Okay. Or is this what I used? I think this is what I used. Yes. Just got to sing me an Ed Sheeran song. Um, I see fire inside Never the mountain. How's that one go? I see fire inside the mountain. Yeah, it definitely doesn't sound familiar. Right. It's from The Hobbit, if you've watched The Hobbit. No, that's uh, a completely different song. That's the Misty Mountains Come. That's the song. A misty mountain, something, something down below. I've got itchy testicles. Oh, now I remember that song. <laughs> when I don't play with them, <laughs> they grow. Wow. That's my problem. You need, yeah, you need to play with Scott's testicles more. <laughs> yeah, I need to stop playing with mine so they grow. <laughs> <coughs> Based on what just happened, I think I could have been a songwriter. Yeah? You think so? Yeah. 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 Why is that? Because that was top quality. Yeah, okay. Sure, whatever you say. Ming. Ming? Ming. What, from Flash Gordon? Oh. Um. He shaves every one of us. <laughs> And it's so fast we didn't even know it because he's Flash. Flash! Ah. Exciting! Ah. Ah. The universe! Boom, 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 boom. Didn't they try and remake that show? Cool. <laughs> Sorry, I was I was counting one, two. Three, four, five, <laughs> I know six, I asked seven, Scott, and he's just eight, standing nine, there and walking ten, around, not saying yeah, anything. 12, Thirteen. Oh, what is this it, atrocity? Does this look like the white the white house? No, it looks like a mess. <laughs> a right mess. I I might have to bring up a picture. I'm not gonna lie. You shall I just do it from shall I do it from what I think it looks like? Sure. I can't wait. And then you can Trump. you can tell me how sure. right I am. Well I can already tell you you're really wrong. You're alt right. How do you expect to make a door with this, Scott? Hold on, is this what it looks like? I mean you, I mean obviously you, it's, it's taller. You, yeah? Than yeah? And significantly wider. For the most part, yeah. I mean, you mean significantly wider. Why are you so racist? I said wider. Oh. Why do you keep hearing everything is white, you racist? I don't know. That's how I was brought up. Being white? Yeah. yeah that's privileged. That's pretty yeah. much how I, mean, I was brought up, Jordan, yeah. To be fair, <laughs> Scott is very grey. Yeah, that's what I thought too. And I'm an Earl. Earl Grey? No. No, you're not. No, James Earl Jones is black. No, no, you're not. What? I'm sorry, you're not. Yeah, James Earl Jones is black. You didn't know that? Is he the one who uh, sung Ghostbusters? <laughs> He's Darth Vader's voice. Oh, right. Pretty much the same person, though. <laughs> I ain't afraid no ghost. Or Darth Vader, as it happens. The I met Darth Vader once. Yeah? How was he? Really? He was, I, I was quite young, but I think he was quite nice. Was it whenever you served on the Death Star? No, he um, he also happened to be um, the Green Cross Code man in our country. Oh, okay. The Green Cross Code being look left and right before you cross the road. Yeah, across, yeah. Um, and he, he was out and about teaching people how to cross the road. I see. Jordan, does this look like the White House? Sure. I feel like you're not impressed. Of course not. Okay, I'm Look at how a... great I did on the other buildings at those trees. I'm Googling a picture. Okay. 